Hello there, my name is Dr. William Bird, and I'm just answering a few questions. One of the questions was concerning vitamin D and whether we should be taking supplements or not. And it came from someone in Scotland, where of course sunlight is much weaker during the winter and extends into April and into September um, at the spring and autumn time. So what do we need to do? Well, first of all, during the summer and actually the winter as well, we try and get as much sunlight as we can. Now this is UVB sunlight. So if you sit behind a window, I'm afraid you're not gonna get your dose of sunlight. You have to be outdoors. It has to be on the face and the forearms. You don't need to get any more than that. And probably about 10 to minutes to half an hour is absolutely fine. That converts um, some of the chemicals in the body to create vitamin D. Now the problem is a lot of people are indoors now, a lot of people are covered up, older people in care homes aren't getting out. So for those people at risk, the advice now is to take 10 micrograms of vitamin D every single day. And the guidelines actually say that every child um, under the age of five, from one to five, should also take 10 micrograms of vitamin D every single day. And the reason is, is that there's this low levels, one in five of us have low levels, and this can lead on to um, slight problems with teeth and bone because it's not being strong um, called, and that's all called osteomalacia in adults but in children it's called rickets where you see the horrible kind of pictures particularly in more third world countries and previously in Victorian times of children with bendy bones which is why the bones haven't been um, set properly because of lack of vitamin D. We aren't quite as bad as that, although rickets is becoming slightly more of a problem. So it's really important to get the sunshine during the um, summer to make sure that you have your oily fishes, your red meat, your egg, um, if you can, which can be in tuna and things like that, can actually help supplement it. But if you don't have those or you're covered up a lot of the time, then take 10 micrograms of vitamin D and every child under the age of five, between one and five, should also take the supplement all year round, not just during the winter when the sunshine is down. I hope that makes that clear. Uh, it's an important question and thanks very much for that.